may well be that Peter Rubato feels happier chasing someone than making pace at the front himself. And Rubato now looking for the inside at the right hander. He's not going to do it. But definitely that Yamaha has speed and he's going to do it now. Round the Yacht Club bend and out onto the straight, on with the power and Rubato. Well, he takes the lead back from his lop as Dave Leach knocks it down to two minutes 37 on the lap. So Leach definitely closing on this front pair, but Rubato now back in front. Took it on the straight and it's quite clear that the Yamaha does have the legs of the Honda on the straight bits. And away goes Rubato. His lot behind him. And look at this. Trevor Nation goes past 59, which is Donald Jacks, the 20-year-old American. And now looks at McCallan. Trevor Nation was dead last after that mistake at Statue Bend and is now, well, right up into the top six at least. McCallan then pursued by Trevor Nation. And I suppose that is a fair indication not only of Nation's commitment but also of the outright speed of these Nortons. And look at the way Leach has closed up with these two. Rubato, his lot. Little breath and then Leach. There was a long gap there earlier on, but it's only a small one now. Is there enough time for Leach to do something about this leading pair? I doubt it very much. Melko Hairpin, Rubato, his lot. Down the hill, they're heading towards the sea. And here they come into the right hand of Fisherman's Bend, Rubato and his lot close behind him. Leach in the picture as well. Along beside the wall to our bend. This really is the fast part of the circuit now. Just a left hander. At reservoir. Rubato is the leader. His lot behind him. His lot turns it on as they come out of the corner. Leach is in third place. The chequered flag is ready. Peter Rubato coming to the line. His lot is going to be second by a tiny gap. And Dave Leach takes the flag in third place. And just look at the gap between them. Well, that got very intense in the last few seconds. Rubato, Hislop, Leach, Robert Dunlop fourth, and Phil McCallan in fifth place.